Hey guys, Saul here. Um, today I have you a little bug report or warning for you guys. I've been seeing a lot of bases with hot pots in the front line of the base, right at the edge of the beach. Um, the beginning, I didn't know why they were doing that, but after a few attacks, it became very apparent that there was some sort of bug with the hot pot and the troop deployment. We know that when we land a troop, with a flag, the troops are going to go to that flag first before engaging any building that's nearest to that flag first. <laughs> Prime example is this. The troops will go in, follow the flag, and then engage whatever's near, uh, whatever's near them after going to the flag. Now, as we saw here, that's sort of the normal behavior. Now, if the hot pot gets activated, by a unit that is not one of your deployable units, which means only the critters, then your troops are not going to follow the flag. The troops are going to go straight away from the landing craft to the nearest building. And this is this is a prime example. Here my friend is activating the hot pot. He lands the flag. The troops sort of initially start to follow the, flare, the flag, but then they go straight out to the nearest um, structure to attack it. Um, and that can be really dangerous because if it's uh, if you're depending on your troops to go to the flag first for safety, and they're not, they're gonna suffer. You're gonna suffer fire. You're gonna you know get casualties from that point. Now, uh, here I'm gonna show you just a couple of different attacks that my friend did, just to try to get at the um, at the source of the of the issue. Uh, what it comes down to is that the error happens only when the hot pot is actually f firing here you see another example hot pot is firing he sent the he sent the critters first landed the troops second and then the troops went haywire okay um let me see if i can show you i'm gonna count here one two three four five six six i think this one the number six it's the one where he Send the troops and use as a flare. You would think that the troops will follow the flare wholeheartedly. Nope. Some of them do. Some of them don't. They go straight out to that defense, like I, like I mentioned earlier. Now, let's go. Let's go take a look at uh, another one of these attacks. Um, again, I'm going to count my apologies. One, two, three, four, five, six, number seven. So here he's, he's landing the troops again. He's sending the critters. So this one is to prove that it's only when the hot pot is, it's, it, if the error happens, if the hot pot was down, came up and then came down. And the answer is the troops are going to follow the troop, the, the, the flare or the flag, no problem at all. They're going to do what they always have done, what we expect them to do. Now on this next example, um... I think it's this one. What happens if a, a, if the troop if if a troop actually if what happens if you shock if you activate the hot pot and shock it then the hot pot is not firing the troops follow the flare. So the issue is not that the hot pot is up or down is that the actual hot pot is firing at the moment when you deploy your troops. That's the issue. Um, let's let's see another example here. My apologies if this seems a little bit um, unscripted because it is. Uh, I just made this test and I think, oh yes, this one is what happens if, if it's an actual troop that activates the, the, the hot pot? The answer to that question is the troops will follow the flare. Even if it was firing um, at the moment that you deploy your flare because it was not a critter, then um, the troops will follow the flare. So again, what, what did we learn from this? If you see a hot pot on the beach, make sure that one, you either avoid it, either avoid activating it with critters, because if you activated it with critters, this can happen. If you activate the, the, the hot pot with critters before you land the troops, then your troops are not going to follow the flare. If you do activate the, the hot pot with critters, make sure you shock it, that it's not actually firing. Because otherwise, your troops, like what we saw a few seconds ago, if you if you don't shock it, 
then the troops are going to, again, go to the hot part. So activate it, shock it, and then everything is going to be normal. All right, guys? So I hope this helped you. I hope this expl explains some sort of the weird issue that you've been observing. Oh, actually, one more thing. This would happen even if, there, for example, this would get complicated. Even if the hot part is on the edge of the map, I didn't actually test it. Um, I, I did... I, I didn't actually um, have a, a, a visual to show you, but if the hot pot is on the edge of the base and you throw a critter pack, and for some reason that critter part lands close to the hot pot and is firing when you land, the same thing is going to happen. It's not only when the hot pot is near the beach, it's anywhere in the base. So, for example, in operation bases, bases if you throw a critter pack and it gets grabbed by a claw, one of the grapplers, and that grappler brings the critter ne next to a hot pot, you're going to have the same effect. Your troops are not going to go where they intend to go, and that on operations can be disastrous. So again, guys, hope this helped you. Hope you enjoyed this. Um, pass the word on. Don't let the hot pot mess your attacks up, okay? So let's check it out.